This video is to show you the kerf hinge that I use on some of the boxes made here at Rolf Woodwork. This uh, piece of wood has a slot here, a very thin slot, and that's where one of the sides of the hinge is inserted. Now, the barrel of the hinge is on the outside position, and this being the inside position of the box. A lid would have two slots, as you see here, and to clear the spring load, spring steel load on the hinge that holds the, the lid open at almost a right angle, or this is the closed and this would be the open position. Now, I use this horizontal boring machine with a square chisel in there to allow for the clearance in the slot area. And it's an asymmetrical position that allows this spring hinge part to house in there and move. Without this additional square chisel hole, I wouldn't be able to insert the kerf hinge all the way. So it's just another phase of it. Now I'll show you the step I go through in getting the square hole and the square chisel in there. Turn on the electricity to this machine. Now, as I say, this is a rather small hollow chisel, square chisel hole, and after I get through I'll show you the final result. So I'm going to place this in the jig that holds it steady in, a con in the same position for this lid piece as it would be for the walled box as you see here. And this particular box has the two corresponding slots for the two hinges that join the box walls to the lid. So here we go. So this would be the right hand side square hole. And correspondingly I would put the walled portion of the box with uh, an allowance for the different height up against this imaginary planar setting and put the square holes in there. So we'll pull this out of here and then you'll see what I've done. There they are. It's a critical fit of where these square holes from the hollow chisel are positioned so if one of the four holes is misaligned you're going to have problems getting the the kerf hinges inserted into the box lid and walls and thus the fit will be off so I'm down to probably a 64th of an inch in positioning not only the slots but the square holes that correspond from lid to walled box. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.